What? What was that? <laughs> I don't have a shotgun. What are you doing? <laughs> gonna gonna do some Alan Wake, huh? Uh, sorry, not. <laughs> what am I doing? John Wick, because you know. Man, I want to listen to that song. But I can't. I'm gonna have to hold up. I'm gonna have to turn that down. Uh, I wonder if I turn off the music. Will it go away? Nope. Okay, I'm just gonna have to cut this. Cut the sound out. You said I've been here before. When was the last time I visited? Let's see exactly what she thinks she remembers. Oh, it's been years. We were all so sad when you left. Shut up. After the accident. Oh, fuck this. My What's up with her eyes? You're remembering wrong. She's at home watching Night Springs with her father. Mm-hmm. No! Oh. It's useless. I need to stop the story. Mandy May and Norman said Tor is hurt. Why didn't you mention that earlier? Oh, you mean the little bump on his noggin? It's nothing. The residents like to exaggerate. Uh-huh. I need to check Tor's room. Alright. What's that? That is a key card. I'm sorry, I have to turn it off. I can't turn it off. Artie, nice to meet you, man. Hello there. Saga Anderson. Hey, Pazine. Name won't make the band worse. Even the Swedish name. I'm Artie. Anything good on that jukebox? We try to do good, but only Prime comes out. <laughs> Music from my Swedish brothers, old gods of Asgard, my pals, the Brickele Vikings. Brickele. Hmm. Do you know where I could find the Andersons? Oh, you can never know where. Only a seaman can know that. But even the seaman can know everything. Fair enough. Thanks anyway. Were you in the band? Minagra? No, no. Not so much sweet that it fills the whole stomach. But uh, we have seen a stage or two. No, Arty, my man. That song's so epic, I just wish I could listen to it. <laughs> Norman, put some clothes on. What if that towel slipped? No one wants to see your meat basket. Not until I've got more sauna. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're good. Old people are fun. Is there more stuff? Oh, hell yeah, there is. You are a handsome deer. What's up with Saga and petting all of these deeds? <laughs> Spilt. Spilt coffee. Oh, what is Sabrim? What? Very old. I shouldn't the interrupt The government him. built a bunker here during World War II to watch the ocean for Axis navies and who knows what else. Ever since Yo, is that Pat the May? bunker, it's been a hot spot for teens. The Ocean View Motel and Spa, they call it. The Ocean View Motel. Oh. They go there. That's sick. Need the key. Huh. No, I could really go for some water right now. This is Tor's room. More moonshine. Was this a drunken rampage? This place is a mess. And Tor's not here. I need to keep looking. Alright, let's jump to the case board. Hold up, what? Ah. Uh -huh. 
How many others? Just one more, huh? Diana, how Excuse you going? Excuse me, miss, but you don't see me barging into your room while you're performing mental and physical strengthening exercises, do you? I thought not. I'm sorry. Just, I'm sorry. <laughs> don't mind me. And now I have to start over. Yeah, you do that. Get more reps out of it that way. Odin's in oh, bad no. shape. He was drunk and watery. Or is this something more wise. serious? One for wisdom to be a seer, I gave up my eye and the light of the moon to shine and see. The many worlds in madness and beyond across the dark dreaming sea, the branching paths of the tree, gave up my eye so many times. We have lived and died and been reborn. We have met here before and will keep on meeting still. Before time, I gave it to Mimir to drink from the well of wisdom, the cauldron. Ooh. Uh, 1976, I took it out myself to see Drake in the Moonshine. Uh, 88, he who stands on the threshold took it from me. The time will come again to be writ again. Can you hear me, Odin? <laughs> Odin Abison, can you hear me? I need to ask you a couple of questions. Odin? He's in no shape to talk. Profiling. Odin's in rough shape. That ain't no hangover, that's, that's something else. These are our twilight years. There's darkness in the water. We have our little tricks. And so do you. What's happening? Whoa. It's never felt this way before. You're all grown up, Saga dearest. And you're back just in time. The forces of darkness are eating away at us. We're too old and weak. You have the power in you. Like all Andersons. What was that? He wasn't a projection. Odin was really here. We were connected. Are they really my family? Is that why this is happening? Yeah, what? I found a photograph of you with the cultists. How are you involved? We're too old for this brand of crazy. But we'll drink with anyone who's offering. The cult's been on our asses to join for years. But we already have our band. And those damn fools don't know what they're dealing with. No wonder they want a pair of legends. Tor and Odin are not part of the cult. The cult thinks there's something special about Tor and Odin. I'm starting to see it too. I've never connected to someone like this in my mind place before. How is this happening? I was glad to answer your call. Vikings are born travelers. You are a seer. You can see the truth. But your grandpa will want to tell you more himself. Wouldn't want to steal his thunder. Tor is in danger. You can save him. Is my mind place more than just a mental technique? Sometimes my mind place even baffles me. The fact that you even Is have the one. Is there something more than intuition behind it? One thing at a time. Tor is in trouble. Once I help him, he can maybe tell me more. You said Tor is in danger. What's going on? Darkness is drawn to the spark. Tor only thinks with his hammer, never his head. The Prince of fucking Darkness is making a comeback. Tor is marked by darkness. I can feel it. Is he in his room? It wants to take him. 
and then take me. Beware of Cynthia Weaver. Bad things happen in the wellness center. Don't let her drag him under, Saga. Does Prince of Darkness refer to Scratch? Is Tor becoming taken? Wait. I need to find him before it's too late. Cynthia Weaver? Stop Wasn't this before more people get hurt? Wasn't that um the Lady of the Light? I found <laughs> Wake's clicker. What can you tell me about it? Cut off from Tom's lamp. It washed to the shore. Good work getting the light switch. The light switch is like an amp. You can play rock and roll without it, but you won't blow anyone away. Art, like Tom's writing, can change the world. But the light switch will crank that change to 11. The clicker has the power to change the story. To save Logan. This confirms what Wake said. I can't let Scratch get his hands on the clicker. By Tom's writing, Odin must mean Wake. Hmm. Deduction available. The clicker makes Wake's writing change reality. Can I trust him with that much power? I mean, he's done it before, hasn't he? Not sure I have a choice. Tor is not okay. Something is definitely going on here. Wellness center. Okay, is there anything else? Yep. Damn, this is a lot. Uh, that one? Not cult members. Really? I could have told you that. That one. Oh, the little, um, little figures, the stick figures. Right? Think, Saga. Okay, that's it. This game is running like absolute dog turd. I don't know what's going on. The light bulb had blown. Meant to replace it days ago. Yeah, is that Cynthia? This will put a smile back on your face, my dear. Sorry? Oh, dear oh, lord. Boy. She's one of them. There must be an overlap here somewhere. That wasn't fun. Don't do that again. Well, hello. Yo. Getting in is forbidden for your own safety. Time is long for those who wait. But in the end, stand to thanks. Sheesh, <laughs> didn't see you there. But whoever remembers that, that's uh it's pretty important. Mandy May. Ah. Excuse me? Wait, so if she's been making these things, who's been leaving the boxes then? Oh, no. Okay. Um... Let me go back down to my safe room. Excuse me. Jerk. That's what I want. Move that away. Move that into here. 
Move that into there. Move that to there. Damn. We've actually gotten quite a bit of stuff from this place. Sick. What? What was that? <laughs> I don't have a shotgun. What are you doing? <laughs> I really don't like all of these sounds. They're not good for my heart, especially after that jump scare that we just had. Oh, hello. Hey, whose room is this? Norman. There's Cynthia. Oh. Okay, Norman, the old mate that's naked downstairs. I have a very, very, very early start tomorrow. Um, very early. Tor's in the wellness center, isn't he? No, he's. Well, yes. But you really shouldn't go in there right now. I'm gonna need you to unlock the door. This is FBI business. It's just... There's some things that, uh... <sighs> yes, okay. I'll let you in. Thank you, Rose. It's so friggin' dark! Watch out for puddles. You can hurt yourself in the dark. Right. Oh. Um, thanks. That lady is a walking red flag. You can hurt yourself in the dark. Wait a second. Isn't this the, um... Uh, no, it isn't. I, I thought it was. Uh, I thought this was the, um... You remember in Al the Dark. first Alan Wake? Empty. Be ready, Saga. Our, um... How... Wake had to... Hello? Tor? Let's heal up. Ugh. It's so dark. Um, yeah, as I was saying, remember how in the beginning of, well, not in the beginning, but in the first one, how, um, Alan had to check into a hotel or something? Yeah, I thought it was the area that you met Stucky. Not Stucky. Um, the ranger dude. Uh, Tor, is Tor Anderson had lightning in his veins. This was rock and roll, baby. Rock and roll? That weaver girl had cast a spell on him. Tor would do anything she'd ask. Tor deserved this. Tor wanted this. She wanted the song. A gift. He had to get it for her. Afterwards, it was too late. Tor swung his hammer in frustration. The spark was gone. Black liquid clogged his mind. A bad trip. Tor fought it. He was strong. He'd never be taken. But the darkness could still drown him. Tor needed to warn someone. It was all happening again. Tom was back. Coming back. Tom would need help too if he was going to make it. But the brothers were too old to stop at this time. 
Tor had called someone. Someone who could help. The name escaped him. Drowned beneath dark water. Ah. Let me grab it. There we go. Tor was here. He's hurt pretty bad. Oh, he is. But he tore off his bandages. Why? What does that say? Rosemary found Mr. Anderson knocked out on the floor by phone, burns on hand and cut on the head. Was out cold, so brought him here, out. Been acting strange all week. Take good care of him. Um. Hold on. Tor, wait! It's me! Oh, oh, oh dear. Come Lord. on. I did that on accident. Why is Cynthia being such a bitch? 